Moving our attention now to a story we have been sharing with you of a mother and her kids who are for now warm and safe. And that's all thanks to generous viewers like you who saw her story right here on 7 Action News. And we're outraged and wanted to help out in their situation. Well, the story doesn't end there. Tonight, the owner of her ice cold apartment is feeling the heat yeah. from the city and from us. 7 Investigator Jim Kurtzner has the latest. We found here on day two that it's going to be several days before all of these problems are fixed. This thing for indoor installation. This upstairs furnace froze with no insulation. The whole house froze. This pipe in the main floor bathroom broke. Water poured into the basement, flooding the main furnace. It's a huge mess, and today, none of it is fixed. Just trying to fix everything as soon as possible. We first showed you yesterday how Shanika Guyton and her family with three young kids lived in this upstairs apartment with no heat since last weekend. She used these space heaters and dangerously ran the stove to try to keep warm until she called us. It's cold. We all in one room trying to keep warm with just a space heater. City of Hamtramck showed up today with two inspectors who found several code violations. They red tagged it. Nobody can live here now. We wanted to know if this owner is a slumlord. Digging deeper, we found he bought this similar duplex a few blocks away in Hamtramck for a measly $6,000 more than a year ago. It still sits empty. He hasn't put a dime into it. Why did you decide to buy these and turn them into rentals so here? Many, so many people, my friend, lives here. So they, I was new. New indeed. He failed to register Shanika's unit with the city. He also says he didn't look too closely at the inspection papers when he bought this duplex a year ago for 48000 bucks. Both properties are now for sale. He also says he will pay for his tenants to stay in a motel. We'll make sure. Has this been a good investment? No, 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 never. I am, I am, I'm never going to do it again. The sticker from the electrical inspector gives the owner 15 days to make just those repairs. City manager tells me the owner has a week to get everything fixed, and everything has to be done by a licensed contractor. In Hamtramck, Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News. Thank you, Jim. Right